Democratic presidential candidate Joe Biden and former President Barack Obama step up their attacks on President Donald Trump and defended their time in the White House in a new video showing their first in-person meeting since the coronavirus outbreak began. The 15-minute video posted online Thursday is the latest maneuver to get the former president involved in the 2020 campaign for his former vice president as Biden tries to rebuild Obama's winning collision in November. Former President Barack Obama and former Vice President Joy Biden used the interview-style conversation to amplify latest arguments against Trump, with Obama emphasizing Biden's experience and personal attributes. They pointed to their administration's signature health care law and blamed Trump for stalking division and animosity among Americans from the moment he entered the 2016 presidential race. They also were sharply critical of the Republican president's effort to combat the coronavirus, which has killed more than 1,40,000 Americans. Can you imagine standing up when you were president and saying, it's not my responsibility, I take no responsibility, Biden says, offering a line of attack similar to his recent campaign speeches when he asserted that Trump quit on the country and has waved the white flag in the pandemic. These words didn't come out of our mouths while we were in office, Obama replies. The pair is shown in the video wearing masks while arriving at an office, then sitting down well apart from each other to observe social distancing for a bare face chat. Biden's campaign to build it as their first face-to-face -face meeting since the coronavirus pandemic began. Obama compared the nation's current economic circumstances to what he inherited when he took office in 2009 after the financial collapse that played out during his general election campaign the previous years. We had to move fast, not just 100 days, Obama said. We had to move in the first month to get the Recovery Act passed, Biden calling Obama. Biden calling Obama, Mr. President, answered that he repeat what he learned. We have got to sustain and keep people from going under forever. The former president largely stayed out of once crowded Democratic primary but endorsed Biden in April when he was the last candidate standing. Obama hosted a virtual fundraiser for his former vice president last month that raised $7.6 million, the most of any Biden campaign event so far. He won then against Democratic becoming complacent and smug. In other exchange, Obama and Biden blast Trump's view of American society and Obama praises Biden as possessing an empathy that Trump lacks. Bureau Report.